finding a guru finding a guide is always a matter of the heart in my own experience i have found i have realized that most of the time your heart tells you the truth when you meet somebody when you listen to somebody when you see somebody your heart knows that here you have met a potentially great being who can show you the path who can walk with you my yeah, heart knows but most of the time the mind starts to interfere the mind has its own set of conditioning its own set of beliefs its own own set of pattern not very easy to convince the mind <laughs> yeah so not that we don't find the right guru but our head interferes look at it look at it in another way analogy have you have you observed honey bee i'm sure we all have observed honey bee right who guides honey bee to find flower let's say you have a garden full of flowers let's say you keep some plastic fake flowers in the garden let's say you have 100 flowers in the garden and you keep you know another 20 flowers as plastic fake flowers what do you think honey bee will do do you think honey bee will go to the fake flower the plastic flower sit there will try to get the nectar from the plastic flower no they've done a research on that and they they found that honey bee for some reason doesn't even go to the plastic flower it knows it knows the real flower it knows where the honey where the nectar would be it doesn't go to the plastic flower there's an there's an intelligence there's a wisdom in honey bee which tells honey bee where is the right flower full of nectar <laughs> yeah that intelligence friends is in all of us if the honey bee has that intelligence do you think you don't have that intelligence as a human being you have vast big mind more sophisticated system you have than honey bee more evolution you have gone through if honey bee has that intelligence we too have that intelligence yeah but with that intelligence with that wisdom with that heartful wisdom we have something called interfering mind based on this projected ego <laughs> this ego interferes we are very close to finding the nectar as honey bee but the mind will tell no no that flower is looking much more bright you move towards that bright flower you reach to that bright flower you realize oh this is plastic mind interfered ego interfered while with honey bee that doesn't happen yeah so that's why i said you know finding a guru is a matter of the heart be like honey bee trust your own self trust your own inner voice trust your own intuitive self it will lead you to the flower full of nectar yeah trust yourself be like a honey bee yeah